Sweet What a wonderful way to spend your day with Ruff Ruff Sweet and Dave. What a fun day, here we go. Yay! Ruff Ruff Sweet and Dave. The spinning girls take us on another great adventure. Say their names. What a great game! So play along at home. We love for the spinning Their names. Here we go. It's Ruff Ruff. Ruff Ruff. Tweet. Tweet. And Dave. Dave. Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave. Yeah. Hello. It's me, Hattie the Hamster. Do you know what makes me different from all the other hamsters you've ever seen? <laughs> That's right. I have a hat full of questions. Let's see if Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave are doing anything different today. Ruff, 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 ruff. Good morning, everyone. Hello, Hattie. I'm making a list of all the things that look different about us. That sounds fun. What differences have you spotted? Tweet's the only one with wings. Flappy flap flap. Ruff Ruff is the only one with floppy ears. Floppy flop flop. How about you, Dave? What special thing makes you look different? I have a smiley mouth for eating bananas. I have a smiley mouth for eating bananas too, see? Me too, but bones are better. Hmm, <laughs> I can't think of anything special that makes me look different. Oh, maybe our adventure will help you find something. What adventure are we going on today, Hattie? Ask the hat! Ask the hat! OK. <laughs> Today we're going on a Spot the Difference adventure! Yeah! yeah! Spot the Difference! I can spot a difference already. Hattie's hat's a different colour. <laughs> yes, it is. Let's see how many more differences we can spot on our adventure. To your roly pods! <laughs> <laughs> Spin again for a spot the difference adventure! Some spot the difference fun. <laughs> Hello, speckly chicken. I know the special thing that makes me look different from Tweet and Ruff Ruff. I have funny feet, so I can walk like a chicken. So, so do, do we. we. Oh. <laughs> I'll have to find something else. Ruff, let's play Spot the Difference. Ruff, ruff, ruff. What do we do? To play the Spot the Difference game, you need to find something that looks different in some way. Ah, uh, I know. Here's an easy one to start with. Try to spot a chicken that's a different colour from all the others. Have you spotted one? Yes! Great! <laughs> I feel a question coming on. Let's play! Game time! Game time! <laughs> Who has seen a chicken that's a different colour from all the others? It's the big chicken! It's the little chicken! It's the black and white speckly chicken! Ruff Ruff says the big chicken is a different colour. Tweet says it's the little chicken. And Dave says... A black and white chicken. But who's right? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes! It's Dave! Hooray! The black and white chicken is a different colour from all the others. The other two are just different sizes. I knew that because I looked at them very carefully. <laughs> That's right, Dave. You need to look carefully when you play Spot the Difference. Let's 
Let's play again. I'm going to win this time. Let's go to my garden for the next Spot the Difference game. <laughs> this game is about spotting something that's a different shape. What shall we choose? Bones. Bananas. Flowers. Oh, that's a great idea to eat. Yeah. yeah. Pretty flowers. <laughs> my hat. I feel a question coming on. Let's play. Game time. Game time. <laughs> Who can spot a flower that's a different shape from all the others? The red flower. The white flower. The yellow flower. Ruff Ruff says the red flower is a different shape. Tweet says the white flower. And Dave says the yellow flower. So who is right? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? It's Dave! <laughs> Again! Yes! My yellow flower is the only one that's a pointy shape. How did you win again? They were all different colours, but only mine was a different shape. Let's play again. I'm going to win this time. No, I'm going to win. Let's find some of my garden vegetables. They're great for playing Spot the Difference. Yay! Yeah! <laughs> Wait for me! <laughs> I found a special thing that makes me different. Only blue panda paws can do this. Oh. Wee, 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 wee. But why give up? There's nothing special about me that makes me look different. Before we play our last Spot the Difference game, I need your help. I want to make another basket just like this. So, can you fill this basket with exactly the same fruit and vegetables? Yes, I'll do it. Me too! <laughs> <laughs> We did it! Thank you. You all did really well. Ooh, <laughs> my hat. I feel another question coming on. Are you ready to play? Game time! Game time! <laughs> These two baskets look a bit different. Who can spot what's missing from your basket? An orange! A potato! A banana! Can you spot the difference between the baskets? What's missing from this basket? Ruff Ruff says it's an orange. Tweet says a potato. And Dave says a banana. Who's right? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes, it's Dave! Yeah! He's got all the questions right today. How do you do it, Dave? I look carefully and I think hard. We did that. <laughs> and I never, ever forget a banana. Now the baskets are the same. Teet, I know the special thing that makes you different, Dave. What? What is it? Your special panda eyes. They spot the difference quicker than all of us. My eyes. My eyes are special. But you can do it too. How, Dave? Look carefully, then think hard about what colour, size and shape things are. I'll show you. Look at those apples. The green one is a different colour from the others. I see something different too. There! That red bird is a different colour from all the others. They're blue. This short bone is a different size to the two long bones. Short, long. Yay! Yay! It's fun to spot the differences all around us every day. And we've had a wonderful Spot the Difference adventure. Things can be a different shape, colour or size. It's not hard to see. Just open your eyes. Think hard too and soon you will be... Great at spotting the difference just like me. Hooray! Oh no! What's wrong, Tweet? Now we can all spot the difference. Dave's special panda eyes don't make him different anymore. I don't mind. I prefer the thing that makes us all the same. What's that? We're all best friends. Best friends! Yay! <laughs> Time to go home, everyone. To the spin again! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for all your 
help today on our Spot the Difference adventure. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the final guessing game, just for you. Can you guess who will fall asleep first today? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? <sighs> It was Dave. It's always Dave. We'll be back for a different adventure soon. <laughs> Until then, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Ruff, Ruff, Tweet and Dave. Ruff, Ruff, Tweet and Dave. What a wonderful way to spend your day with Ruff, Ruff, Tweet and Dave. What a fun day. Here we go. Yay! Ruff, Ruff, Tweet and Dave. The spinning girls take us on another great adventure. Say their names. What a great game! So play along at home. We will fall asleep again. Who knows what we might find? With Hattie the hamster taking us there, we know we'll, we'll have a magical time. A magical time! Play along at home. Say their names. Here we go. It's Ruff Ruff. Ruff Ruff. Tweet. Tweet. And Dave. What a wonderful way to spend my day with Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave. Hello, I'm Hattie the Hamster with my hat full of questions and a bubble copter full of parcels. Look, why don't you help me deliver them? First stop, Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave's Hilltop home. <laughs> Ruff Ruff! Ruff! Hattie's here! Hello, Hattie. Hi, Hattie. Hello. What is it, Hattie? Special delivery for... Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I'm all right. Who's this one for, Hattie? Look at the stickers on the parcel, Dave. They're called labels. One shows who the parcel is for and the other shows where to deliver it. It's a picture of Ruff Ruff. Yes, and that's my house. So the parcel is for Ruff Ruff. Oh, I hope it's a squeaky bone. <laughs> It is! Ruff, ruff Who's the other parcel for, Hattie? We'll find out who on our adventure. What adventure are we going on today, Hattie? Ask, Ask the hat! hat. Ask, Ask the hat! hat. OK. <laughs> today we're going on a special delivery adventure! Hooray! A special delivery adventure! To your roly pods! <laughs> <laughs> Spin again for a special delivery adventure! for some special delivery fun! Can't stop, Fluffy Sheep! We've got a parcel to deliver! Whee! Whee! <laughs> yeah. Morning, Miss Cow! Very important parcel coming through! Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 mm -hmm. Enjoying your breakfast, Carrot Mr Rabbit! <laughs> and here's the parcel. But who is it for? We need to look at the labels. It looks like a fluffy cloud. How can we deliver a parcel to a cloud? The other picture tells us where that animal lives. In long, tall grass. Whoa! <laughs> I feel a game coming on. Let's play! Game time! Game time! <laughs> knows who the parcel is for. Remember, they look like a woolly cloud and live in the long grass. The cow! The fluffy sheep! Me! <laughs> look at the label and see if you can tell who has the right answer. Ruff Ruff says the cow. Tweet says the fluffy sheep. And Dave says... <laughs> Dave! Who's right? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yeah! 
Yes, it's Tweet! Hooray! The sheep we saw was fluffy like a cloud. And she was in the long grass. So that must be where she lives. Let's go! We're the special delivery crew. We're the special delivery crew. We bring your parcel straight to you. We bring your parcel straight to you. <laughs> special delivery for fluffy sheep. <laughs> hey, it's full of hay. Ruff, ruff, ruff. Look, what's this? Fluffy sheep has another parcel. Would you like us to deliver it for you? <laughs> With a special delivery crew, we bring your parcel straight to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait! <gasps> Up. Oh, no! Where do we take this parcel? Let's look at the labels. <gasps> look! Oh, no! They've gone! Phew! Oh, I caught one of them, but the other one blew away. Let's look at the picture. It's for somebody who lives in a hole under a tree. But who? Maybe if we look carefully at the parcel, we can work out who it's for. <laughs> it looks like a pointy orange banana. It doesn't smell like a banana. It's a carrot. This parcel must be for someone who lives in a hole in the ground and likes carrots. Woo! <laughs> it must be game time. Let's play! Game time! Game time! <laughs> who is this parcel for? The rabbit! The cow! Me! Ruff Ruff says the parcel is for the rabbit. Tweet says the cow. And Dave says... <laughs> Dave! Again! Do you know who's right? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes! It's Ruff Ruff! Yes! I was right! The picture looked just like the hole that Mr Rabbit hopped into. And rabbits love carrots. <laughs> now we can deliver the parcel. With a special delivery crew, we bring your parcel straight to you. <laughs> <laughs> special delivery for Mr Rabbit. Oh. <laughs> 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 Hello, bunnies. <laughs> Ruff, another parcel. Can we deliver it for you? <laughs> Let's look at the labels. That's a crab. And that's a pool in the rocks with sand all around it. A rock pool. We have to deliver the parcel to the crab who lives in the rock pool. Where's that? Oh, my hat. It's time to play another game. Game time! Game time! <laughs> Where will we find the crab's rock pool home? On a rocky mountain. In the woods. On the beach. Who's right? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes! It's Dave! Yes! <laughs> Let's take this parcel to the beach. I love the beach. Let's go! With a special delivery crew, we bring your parcel straight to you. <laughs> Can you see a rock pool? It looks like this. Hmm. Uh, uh. I can. Over there. <laughs> <laughs> Special delivery for Mr. Mr. Crab. <laughs> a birthday cake. Happy birthday, <laughs> Mr. Crab. <laughs> you mean snappy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> snappy birthday. Oh, a special delivery for each of us. This one's mine. This one's for me. This is mine. Wow, we're all invited to Mr Crab's birthday party. Yay! <laughs> this is the best snappy birthday party ever. <laughs> and we've had a great special delivery adventure too. Yes. 
We had lots of parcels. But where did they go? We looked at the labels because we didn't know. There were pictures to show us who each box was for. And pictures of places they lived to make sure. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> With a special delivery crew, we bring your parcels straight to you. Hooray! <laughs> Time to go home, everyone. To the spin again! Yay! <laughs> Bye, Mr. Thank Crab. You for us. It's our happy birthday. Here we go. <laughs> Thanks for all your help today. And now our three friends have been delivered safely back home. <laughs> oh, the final guessing game, just for you. Can you guess who will fall asleep first today? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? <sighs> it was Dave. It's always Dave. <laughs> I'm looking forward to delivering more adventures very soon. Until then, bye-bye! Bye-bye! Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! What a wonderful way to spend your day with Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! What a fun day, here we go! Yay! Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! The spinning gun will take us on another great adventure. Say their names. What a great game! So play along at home. We love all the spinning gun. Who knows what we might find? With Hattie the hamster taking us there, we know we'll have a magical time. A magical time! Play along at home. Say their names. Here we go. It's Ruff Ruff. Ruff Ruff. Tweet. It's me, Hattie the Hamster, and today I've got a hat full of questions and a juicy apple to eat. Yum! Apples are my favourite fruit. Let's visit Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave and see if they like apples too. Morning, Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave. Morning, Hattie. Hi, Hattie. Hello, Hattie. What's that you're eating, Hattie? A delicious apple. Oh, I love apples. What's your favourite fruit, Ruff Ruff? I love bones. That's not a fruit, Ruff Ruff. <laughs> oh. What's your favourite tweet? I love all kinds of fruit. Apples, strawberries, blueberries. Well, I like bananas. Yes, we know. <laughs> it's always bananas for you, Dave. Bananas are great, but... It's good to try different things, too. I do! Banana pie, banana sandwich, banana splits! <laughs> <laughs> no, Dave. Something different from bananas. Like apples! What's so special about apples, Hattie? Well, they're tasty and good for you. And the best thing is, they come from nature. Cool! In fact, I've grown some in my garden. What adventure are we going on today, Hattie? Ask, Ask the hat! Ask, Ask the hat! hat. <laughs> okay. Ooh, today we're going on an apple tree adventure! Yay! Apple an apple tree, tree adventure! Hooray! Hooray! To your roly pods! <laughs> <laughs> Spin again for an apple tree adventure! <laughs> wow! Hmm. 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 Rough! No apples here, no 
apples there, no apples anywhere. Hmm, I can't see any bananas either. I can see strawberries and I can see blueberries. Maybe the apples are hiding. Yoo-hoo! Apples, come out, come out wherever you are. Oh, my hat. I feel a question coming on. Are you ready to play? Game time, game time! <laughs> Who knows where apples grow? Apples grow in a hole in the ground. They grow on top of the ground like strawberries. Apples grow on a tree. Who do you think is right? Ruff Ruff says apples grow in a hole in the ground. Tweet says they grow on top of the ground. And Dave says they grow on trees. Who's right? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes, it's Dave! Hooray! I knew that because I saw apples on the tree over there. Yay! Yay! They were hiding there all the time. Oh dear, the tree has dropped some. Go back in the tree, little apple. Oof! Oops! <laughs> I'm all right. It's OK, Dave. The tree wants the apples to fall. Why does the tree want to do that? Because that means they're ready to eat. I could fly up and eat the apples in the tree. Hello, juicy red apple. But we can't fly like you, Tweet. Yeah, when they drop on the ground, we can all reach them. <laughs> Great, let's eat. Remember the hatty rule? Ask before you pick so you don't risk getting sick. Apples that have been lying on the ground too long are not good to eat. But these are just perfect. Here. Yay! 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 <laughs> mm, yum, yum, yum! Ruff, ruff, I can see something in the middle of the apple. Oh! What are they, Hattie? Oh, my hat! <laughs> it's time to play another game. Game time! Game time! <laughs> what has Ruff, ruff found in the middle of the apple? I know, tiny bones. No, they are seeds. They look like pebbles to me. Do you know who's right? Ruff Ruff says he found tiny bones in the apple. Tweet says they are seeds. And Dave says they are pebbles. Who's right? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes, Tweet is right. Yay! I knew that because they look just like my favourite birds. Seed. And apple seeds have a special name. Are they called Dave? <laughs> They're not called Dave. They're called Pips. Pips! 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 pips. <laughs> if Pips are apple seeds, then they must grow into new apple trees. Yes, that's right, Dave. Look! That bluebird's trying to get that apple. Ruff! You need to ask Catty first, little bird. <laughs> it's OK for the bird to have the apple. He might eat the pips and drop them somewhere else. And a new tree will grow there. That's right to eat. Oh, that apple has gone. Ooh, <laughs> I feel a question coming on. Let's play. Game time, game time. <laughs> Who knows what happened to the apple we saw by the tree? The bird flew away with it. <laughs> Dave ate it. It was blown away by the wind. <sighs> Do you know who's right? Ruff Ruff says the bluebird flew away with it. Tweet thinks Dave ate it. And Dave says the wind blew it away. Who's right? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes! Ruff Ruff is right! Woohoo! I knew that because I saw the bird fly off of it when you weren't looking. To drop the pips and the pips will grow into new apple trees. I've got a blue panda idea. I'm going to drop some seeds too. Bye-bye, <laughs> Pip. Hmm, no apple tree yet. Not even a sniff of one. Oh, you have to wait a long time for a tree to grow. How long? Until bedtime? No, Dave. Longer than that. It needs sunshine, rain, food from the ground and a long time to make it grow. 
Enjoy growing into a big tree, little Pip. Take your time. <laughs> <laughs> You've learned so much today. Well done, everyone. Yay! I never knew apple trees could be so clever. Nearly as clever as you. More juicy apples for everyone. Yum, yum! <laughs> <laughs> And here you are, Dave. Huh? Ta-da! Your favourite fruit. Hmm. No thanks, Hattie. Today, I'd rather have an apple. Huh? huh? Wow! Are you feeling OK, Dave? Oh. OK? I feel apple fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> what a great adventure we've had in my garden. We learnt about apples. Apples grow on trees. And the pips inside them are also called seeds. Eating an apple is a great thing to do. They help us stay healthy. Yes, Tweet, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Time to go home, everyone. To the spin again. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for all the help you gave us on our apple tree adventure. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the final guessing game, just for you. Can you guess who will fall asleep first today? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? <sighs> it was Dave. It's always Dave. Mmm, apples are apple fantastic. <laughs> Until our next adventure, bye bye. Bye bye. Ruff, Ruff, Tweet, and Dave. Ruff, Ruff, Tweet, and Dave. What a wonderful way to spend your day with Ruff, Ruff, Tweet, and Dave. What a fun day. Here we go. Yay! Ruff, Ruff, Tweet, and Dave. The spinning girls will take us on another great adventure. Say their names. What a great game! So play along at home. We will fall asleep again. Who knows what we might find? With Hattie the hamster taking us there, we know we'll have a magical time. A magical time! Play along at home. Say their names. Here we go. It's Ruff Ruff. Ruff Ruff. Tweet. It's me, Hattie the Hamster, with my hat full of questions. Whoa! My bubble copter's super powered today. That means we'll travel super fast to see what Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave are up to. Up! Oh. <laughs> Hello, Ruff Ruff! Whee! Woohoo! Yeah! Oh, good morning, Tweet and Dave. Whoa! <laughs> Ruff, we're superheroes! And we're ready to use our superpowers! Ruff, yes! What are our superpowers? Um, flying? Super banana eating? <laughs> Maybe we can find out what your superpowers are on our adventure today. Yay! What adventure are we going on today, Hattie? Ask the hat! Ask the hat! OK. <laughs> Today we're going on a superpower adventure! Yay! A superpower adventure! Yes! Yeah. Superpowers! To your roly pods! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Spin again for a super power adventure! Time to use 
use our superpowers. <laughs> yeah! Here comes Super Day. <laughs> I'm super fast, super rough, rough. Hello, little sheep. Hello, big sheep. <laughs> Ooh, pretty bell, big sheep. Oh, there you are, Tweet. No, <laughs> I'm Super Tweet. <laughs> tweet, Tweet. Wait for me! Oh, <laughs> and me! Hey, everyone! I found my superpower! Look! I can make myself invisible! <laughs> <laughs> we can still see you, Ruff Ruff! Really? Oh, Ruff! <laughs> oh, sounds like someone's in trouble. <laughs> the sound is coming from over there! It's superpower time! <laughs> What's the matter, little sheep? Have you lost big sheep? Ruff, we're superheroes with superpowers. We'll find big sheep for you. Yeah! <laughs> Good luck! <laughs> ruff, 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 ruff. Not down there. Ribbit. Huh? Ribbit. <laughs> Ribbit. Ribbit. Morning, Mr Frog. Ribbit. Sorry, little sheep. We can't see her. Thing. So can I. Ribbit, ribbit. Me too. Oh, my hat. I feel a game coming on. Are you ready to play? Game time, game time. <laughs> Who can hear the sound that Big Sheep is making? <laughs> Me. I can hear Big Sheep making a buzz sound. Me! Big Sheep is making a ding-dong sound. Ribbit, ribbit. Me! Big Sheep is going ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> well, you're all hearing something. But who has heard the right sound for Big Sheep? Is it Ruff Ruff? Bzz, bzz. Tweet? Ding-dong. Or Dave? Ribbit, ribbit. Who's right? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes, it's Tweet! Yay! I knew Ding Dong was the right sound for Big Sheep because I heard her bell earlier. I've got super listening powers. <gasps> Listen, it's over there. <laughs> hmm. hmm. Look, Sheep Wool. Well spotted, Dave. Oh, and good listening, Tweet. Is this from Big Sheep? <laughs> yeah. Look! There's some more! Big Sheep must have come this way! Yeah! yeah. I hear her this way too! <laughs> no ding-dongs! No more wool! We've lost Big Sheep! Which way do we go now? <laughs> oh dear! Little Sheep is sad and sniffy! <laughs> sniffy? I can sniff too! Maybe we can all use our noses to find big sheep. Ruff! Ruff, ruff, ruff! This path smells woolly. I can smell pretty flowers. I can smell bananas. Do sheep smell like bananas, Hattie? <laughs> I don't know, but I do feel a question coming on. It's time to play! Game time! Game time! <laughs> Who knows what sheep smell of? Wool! Pretty flowers! Bananas! Ruff Ruff says sheep smell of wool. Tweet says they smell of flowers. And Dave says they smell of bananas. Who has the right answer? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? That's right! It's Ruff Ruff! Sheep smell of wool. I knew that because I'd smelled little sheep and she smells all woolly too. You've got super smelling powers, Ruff Ruff. Yes, I'm a super smeller. Let's follow this path. This way. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm a super listener. I hear another ding dong. Yeah, I see big sheep. Bear, bear, bear. Aww. Well, 
Well done, everyone. You did it. You used your superpowers to help little sheep. Yay! But I haven't found my superpower yet. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. What's wrong with little sheep now? She's looking for something. What can it be? We found big sheep. Oh, my hat. It's time to play another game. Game time, game time. <laughs> Who knows what little sheep is looking for? A bone. Somewhere to lie down. A blue flower. So, who knows what little sheep is looking for? Ruff Ruff says she's looking for a bone. Tweet says she's looking for somewhere to lie down. And Dave says she's looking for her blue flower. Who's right? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes, it's Dave! Hooray! I knew I was right because I saw she had lost her blue flower. Yay! You found your superpower, Dave! I did! I'm Super Spotter Dave! Look! The lost flower! <laughs> Hats off to everyone for helping little sheep! You've all got superpowers in our superpower adventure! We're Super Rough Rough, Tweet and Dave! We found the little lost sheep to save! With our superpowers of looking... And listening... Not forgetting... <laughs> super sniffing! <laughs> <laughs> we found Little Sheep's big sheep friend! Her flower too! And that's a happy way to end! Yay! Now that was a super, super power adventure! Come on everyone, to the spin again! <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! Woohoo! Thank you for all your help on our superpower adventure. <laughs> oh, the final guessing game, just for you. Can you guess who will fall asleep first today? Ruff Ruff, Tweet, or Dave? <sighs> it was Dave. It's always Dave. Until our next super adventure, bye-bye! Bye-bye! Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! What a wonderful way to spend your day with Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! What a fun day, here we go! Yay! Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! The spinning girls take us on another great adventure, say their names! What a great game! So play along at home! We love Here we go, it's Ruff Ruff! Ruff Ruff! Tweet! Tweet! And Dave! Dave! Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave! Yeah! Hello! <laughs> it's me, Hattie the Hamster, with my hat full of questions. What kind of adventure will we have today? Watch Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave and see if you can tell. Morning, Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave. Hello, Hattie. Look, there's a star in my favourite book. I love stars. I know a song about a star, Tweet. Far above me there you are. Yes, you are my favourite star. Ooh, I really, really like your song. Can I sing it too? Of course you can, Tweet. Let's sing it together. One, two, three, four. Far above me there you are Yes, you are my favourite star I wish I had my very own star But I don't know where to find one I don't see any stars round here Hmm, 
Where can we find stars? Maybe we'll find stars on our adventure. What adventure are we going on today, Hattie? Ask the hat! Ask the hat! OK. <laughs> today we're going on a story adventure. A story adventure. I love stars. Oh, look at your hat, Hattie. I hope I find a star just as pretty as that one. Let's go and see. To your roly pods. <laughs> <laughs> the spin again for a story adventure! It's time for some starry fun! <laughs> <laughs> come on, stars! Come out, come out, wherever you are! They're up there somewhere. In my book, the stars keep the moon company at night. I just need to fly really high to reach them. Uh, uh, I can't fly high enough. Where, oh, where is my favourite star? <laughs> Ooh, my hat! I feel a question coming on. Are you ready to play? Game time! Game time! <laughs> Why can't we see the stars right now? Because we're looking in the wrong place. Because the stars are shy. Because it's not night time. Who do you think has the right answer? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes! Dave is right! Yay! I knew that because Tweet's book had a picture of the moon and stars at night time. That's right. You only see real stars in the sky when it's dark. Why, Hattie? Well, during the day, the stars are still there. You just can't see them because the sky is so bright. We'll have to wait for night time. Or, if you look carefully, you can see star shapes everywhere, even in the daytime. Oh, let's find star shapes. Star shapes, star <laughs> shapes. <laughs> would you like to help us look for star shapes too? You would? Great. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Ruff, a box with stars. Let's look inside. Do you see anything starry, Dave? Yes, I found a star shape at the end of this wand. Ruff, let's go and find some more stars. Ooh, I found a star-shaped flower. Oh. Ruff, ruff, ruff. What's Ruff, ruff doing? Ruff, ruff. One, two, three, four, five. You don't find stars in the ground, Ruff, ruff. No, but I can dig a star. Look. You dug a star-shaped hole, Ruff Ruff. So, who's found a star shape? Me! <laughs> I feel a game coming on. Let's play! Game time! Game time! <laughs> <laughs> Who has found something that's star-shaped? Like the star on my hat. My hole in the ground is star-shaped. My flower is star-shaped. The end of my magic wand is star-shaped. Who do you think has found something star-shaped? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Or maybe it's more than one of them. <laughs> That's right. It's Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave. They're all right. <gasps> That's never happened before. Yay! We did it! Yay! I love all of our star shapes, but I'd still like my very own star that isn't a flower, a wand or a hole. Like the one in our song. Yes. Far above me there you are. Yes, you are my favourite star. I've got a blue panda idea. Let's make a star for Tweet. Yay! <laughs> 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 ruff, ruff, 
Over here! Lots and lots of shapes. Let's see if we can find a star shape. Uh, um, none of these are star shapes. So how can we make a star? Rough! These pointy shapes look like bits of star. Maybe we can stick them together. Good idea! How many pointy shapes do we need to make Tweet's favourite star, Hattie? Hmm. Sometimes to find the right answer, you need to ask the right question. Whoa! <laughs> I feel another game coming on. Let's play! Game time! Game time! <laughs> How many points does Tweet's favourite star have? Here's a hatty hint. It looks just the same as the star on my hat. Tweet star has five points. Uh, my star has three points. Tweet star has 19 points. Who has the right answer? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes! Ruff Ruff is right. Tweet star has five points. Yay! I remembered stars have five points because I counted them when I dug my star-shaped hole in the ground. One, two, three, four, five. Well done, Ruff Ruff. Yay! And it's just like the star on my hat, too. Three points isn't enough, and 19 points is too many. <laughs> I knew that. I was only joking. Let's try putting five pointy pieces together, Ruff Ruff. One, two, three, four, five! A star! A proper star! It's perfect! Look! It's night time! Time for real stars! <gasps> wow! There's the moon, and right next to it, there's a real star! Just like in my book! Far above me, there you are! Yes, you are my favourite star! And that was a great starry adventure. To find a star when it's not night, we looked for shapes while it was light. A wand, star flowers, even a hole. But a star for Tweet. That was our goal. We found five points to make a star. And far above me, there you are. Yay! Far above me, there you are. Yes, you are my favourite star. Ah, it's time to go home, everyone. To the spin again! <laughs> Whee! We made a star for Tweet, but we couldn't have made it without your help. So thank you. <laughs> oh, the final guessing game, just for you. Can you guess who will fall asleep first today? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? <sighs> it was Dave. It's always Dave. Until our next adventure, starring Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave. Bye bye! Bye bye! Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave! Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave! What a wonderful way to spend your day with Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave! What a fun day, here we go! Yay! Ruff Ruff Tweet and Dave! The spinning gun will take us on another great adventure. Say their names. What a great game! So play along at home. We will fall the spin again. Who knows what we might find? With Hattie the hamster taking us there, we know we'll have a magical time. A magical time! Play along at home. Say their names. Here we go. It's Ruff Ruff. Ruff Ruff. Tweet. Tweet. And Dave. Hello! I'm Hattie the Hamster, with my hat full of questions. <laughs> I'm off to see my friends, Ruff Ruff, Tweet and Dave. <laughs> well, what's happening here? 
<laughs> Morning, Hattie. We're pretending to be racing cars. <laughs> <laughs> beep, beep. You're in my way, Raff Raff. Make way for day. King of the road. <laughs> be careful you don't crash. Beep, beep. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> We're all right. Driving is a lot more fun when you don't bump into each other. It's not easy when we all drive at the same time. How can we stop bumping into each other? Maybe you'll find out on our adventure. What adventure are we going on today, Hattie? Ask, Ask the hat! Ask, Ask the hat! hat. <laughs> OK. <laughs> today we're going on a driving adventure. A driving adventure! <laughs> Don't forget to buckle up to your roly pods! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> All aboard the spin again for a driving adventure! Let's go driving! This is fun! <laughs> Yay! Stop! It's Mr. Squirrel! Why has he stopped in front of that red light on a stick? <laughs> Look! There's a green light now and Mr. Squirrel is running again! Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> it's another red light. Let's take a closer look. Up. Aha! Uh -huh. I see you found another traffic light. Rough. It went from green to red. But I haven't a blue panda idea what that means. <laughs> Oh, my hat! I feel a question coming on. Are you ready to play? Game time! Game time! <laughs> what does this red light mean? Rough. It's telling us to stop. It's telling us to go. It means time for a banana. <laughs> Rough Ruff says the red light means stop. Tweet says it means go. And Dave says it means time for a banana. Hope. So who do you think is right? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? Yes! It's Ruff Ruff! Yay! A red light always means stop. I knew that because I remember Mr Squirrel stopped when the light was red. But why does the traffic light want us to stop? Oh, I know why. Look! The light tells us to stop so we don't bump into the snail that's crossing the road. That's right, Dave. Traffic lights help us to cross the road safely. And if red means stop, then green means... Go! <laughs> <laughs> Up! Wait for me! Look! Another thing on the stick! What have you found now? A tall stick with a picture of a cow on it. That's what we call a road sign. Ooh! Uh, why is there a picture of a cow on the road sign? I don't know, but I can hear some cows. Ooh! <laughs> I feel another question coming on. Are you ready to play? Game time! Game time! <laughs> Why is there a picture of a cow on a sign next to the road? Ruff, it's a nice picture to look at. It tells us there might be cows crossing the road. It's asking if anyone has seen a lost cow. So, what does the sign mean? Ruff Ruff says it's a nice picture to look at. Tweet says it tells us there may be cows crossing the road. And Dave says it's asking if anyone has seen this lost cow. But who's right? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? 
tweet is right. Hooray! I knew that because I heard some cows mooing. <laughs> That's right, Tweet. The sign tells us there may be cows on the road ahead. <laughs> <laughs> so you better drive slowly. We, we will. will. Hello, cows. It's a good thing the sign told us about the cows. It stopped us bumping into them. They've all crossed the road now. That means you can drive on safely. Bye-bye, cows. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Done, Ruff Ruff. Oh, Mrs Chicken didn't see you. It's lucky you saw her. She still wants to cross the road. We need to help her. She's at the right spot. See those stripes on the road? She's at a crossing place. But how can we help her cross safely? There aren't any red lights telling us to stop. Or a sign with the picture of a chicken telling us she's here. Can you remember the way to cross the road safely, Ruff Ruff? I'll show you, Mrs Chicken. Look out! Here comes Speedy Sheep! Whoa! We almost got bumped! I know how to cross safely. We stop first, then look to see if anything is coming. Now we cross! Whoa! I'll show you the blue panda way to cross the road. Stop, look. And listen. <laughs> now we can cross the road. And keep looking and listening all the time. <laughs> oh, my hat's telling me there's another question coming on. Are you ready to play? Game time! Game time! the safest way to cross the road. Ruff, cross the road fast without looking. Stop and look to check if anything is coming. Find a crossing place, stop, look and listen to check if anything is coming. So, who do you think knows the safest way to cross the road? Is it Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? <laughs> That's right, it's Dave! When Dave led us across the road, we stopped, looked and listened <laughs> to check it was safe to cross the road. Well done, Dave! <laughs> Goodbye! Bye -bye. Bye -bye. That was a great driving adventure! A red light means stop and green is for go. <laughs> Following this rule is the best way we know. Signs are your friends. They keep you from harm. Showing cows on a sign is like an alarm. To cross the road safely, you must stop, look and listen. And that's how we helped our good friend the chicken. <laughs> and now it's time to drive home. And don't forget to buckle up to the spin again! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> had a great driving adventure today. Thanks for all your help. <laughs> oh, the final guessing game, just for you. Can you guess who will fall asleep first today? Ruff Ruff, Tweet or Dave? <sighs> it was Dave. It's always Dave. Until our next adventure, this is Hattie the Hamster saying buckle up and bye-bye! Bye-bye! <laughs>